developing right now. Philadelphia police say they know who killed the manager of a Lehigh Avenue Dunkin Donuts early Saturday morning. He's currently being held in Delaware and they say he could be tied to other murders. Our Jeff Cole is live at the Roundhouse with what police are saying about this. Jeff. Yeah, fast moving events here. Keith Gibson, 39 years old. Police say he is the killer of Christine Lugo, the manager of a Dunkin' Donuts on Lehigh Avenue, who was followed into the store early Saturday morning and shot in the head. But Gibson, as you say, being held in Delaware, may be linked to a series of other killings, including that of his mother. A sign mourning the loss of Christine Lugo rests in the window of the Lehigh Ave Dunkin' Donuts where the 41-year-old lost her life when shot in the head by a robber early Saturday morning. Police now say 39-year-old Keith Gibson, caught on a security camera, is the killer. We believe Mr. Gibson is the perpetrator at the um, Lehigh Avenue murder of Ms. Lugo. I spoke to the district attorney within the hour. Uh, they are in the process of approving a warrant for us. Investigators say they tied Gibson to the murder after police from Ellesmere, Delaware, alerted them to a similar killing. An employee of a cell phone store, Leslie Basilio, was shot in the head last month. Gibson picked up early Tuesday after the alleged gunpoint robbery of a Rite Aid in Delaware may now be linked to a series of killings, including the murder of his mother at her job in a Ridge Ave, Philadelphia counseling center in February. We're expecting there could very well be charges in that case sometime today. And there's more. Investigators are taking another look at the killing of two men shot in the head in a business along the 3600 block of Germantown Ave earlier this year. Police plan to bring Gibson here from Delaware where he's being held and say they did speak to him after his mother's killing. We did have him. At that point, we could not link him to the murder and he was sent back to Delaware uh, in custody and did get out of custody again sometime in March. Police say there's painstaking work still to do in the many cases, while Christine Lugo's customers are outraged. He's a coward. He's an absolute coward. Uh, I heard that possibly he had done some other things as well. You know, maybe he's sick, but I wish that they had, had security here. Now, Lugo was opening the Dunkin' Donuts very early on Saturday morning. Security wouldn't have been there at that point anyway, it would appear. Now, police say that Gibson could be linked to as many as four killings. Now, he has spent time in prison before a Cadillac Escalade taken from the Ellesmere, Delaware site of that killing was found just a few blocks from the killing on at Dunkin' Donuts on Lehigh Ave, just a few blocks away, the same vehicle. Live here at the Roundhouse Police Headquarters, Jeff Cole, Fox 29 News. Folks. All right, Jeff, thank you very much. Ben Salem.